and move to the latest in court today as detectives and forensic experts reveal evidence against the man who was accused of killing Danielle Stislicki. Danielle disappeared in 2016. She was never found, but right now her former co-worker Floyd Galloway Jr. is in court. That's where a judge will decide if there's enough evidence to send him to trial for murder. Testimony yesterday indicated that Danielle and Galloway did text each other and that they were seen in a car together before she vanished. Then this morning, a state police expert testified that Danielle's DNA was found on carpet in Galloway's apartment. So based on the DNA results from the carpet swabs, it is at least 32 septillion times more likely if the DNA originated from Danielle Soslicki and three unrelated unknown contributors than if the DNA originated from four unrelated unknown contributors. So this provides very strong support that Danielle Soslicki is a contributor to the DNA profile from the carpet swabs. Right now, Galloway is serving time for a sexual assault in Livonia. Now, testimony in this case is expected to continue throughout the week. And of course, we will be in the courtroom. We'll keep you updated on any new developments, both on air and WXYZ.com.